Hello, today I'm doing a marker report for Wellington's Edge in Wellington, Florida, brought to you by Mark Baker and buyingpalmbeachhomes.com. In this video, I'm gonna cover the current market and the type of listings that are available, current market prices of those listings, and then the metrics on the 90 day sold properties, including property type and financing terms. We're gonna start off by taking a look at the current market within this community. Now currently, there's 13 properties that are on the market within this community. Now of those 13, two properties are on the contract mark contingent, five properties are on the contract mark pending, one is accepting backup offers, leaving five properties that are currently available to be purchased in Wellington's Edge in Wellington, Florida. Now we're gonna take a look at the market activity on the currently listed properties. We have no new activity within the last 10 days. All five of the properties that are currently available to be purchased are traditional sales. Next, we're gonna take a look at the prices within the community. On the low end, we have $245,000 for a three bedroom, two bath home with 1820 under air. On the high end, we have $299,000 for a three bedroom, two bath home with 1860 under air. And then the median price in this community comes in at $245,000. Next, we're gonna take a look at the sold properties. In the last three months, five properties have sold with this, in this community. Now, the average sales price was $225,000. The average sales price per square foot came in at $139, with the range on the low end of $123 per square foot up to $161 per square foot. Then the average days on market came in at 69 days. Next, we're gonna take a look at the sales to list price on the five properties that have recently sold. Now this is the percentage that the buyers paid as it relates to the list price of the property. On the low end, someone paid 0.91 or 91% of the list price the average came in at 0.97 or 97% of the list price. And on the high end, someone paid 1% over list price to get the most sought after property within this community. Of the five properties that recently sold, three were traditional sales and two were bank foreclosures. Next, we're gonna take a look at the financing terms of the deals that recently closed. Four deals closed with cash, and one closed assumable. If you're looking to buy or sell your home in Wellington's Edge, let me put my experience to work for you. Thank you for watching this Mark Report on Wellington's Edge. To list your property, or to set up a showing, you can contact me at 561-336-6333 or you can visit me online at buyingpalmbeachhomes.com. Please rate and comment and thanks for watching one of my videos.